Our topic for today, what is a thermocouple and how it works? A thermocouple is a sensor is used to measure temperature in a number of processes. Thermocouple consists of two wire made from the similar metals, which are combined together at one end, creating a junction. When temperature changes between these wires, it produces voltage as an output, which can be displayed on the multimeter. These voltages are very low in millivolts. The advantage of thermocouple is that they can detect very minor changes in temperature over a very large temperature range. It can also detect any changes in temperatures very quickly. Type K is the most common and general purpose thermocouple. Type K probes are reliable, inexpensive, and has a wide temperature range. Temperature measurement is very important and is needed in every industry. Measurement is always there, whether in the process industry, oil and gas, nuclear power plant, automotive, aircraft, and pharmaceutical. Temperature measurement is always there. The thermocouple-based metals are type E, N, J, K, etc. Known are the most common categories. The material from which these thermocouples are made are inexpensive and commonly available metals, such as iron, copper, nickel, etc. Below are the details of each type of base metal thermocouple. Type E thermocouple having a chromel as a positive leg and constantan as a negative leg. Chromel having a percentage of 10% nickel, while constantan has a 45% nickel. Type J, a thermocouple having iron as their positive leg, with constantan as the negative leg. Type K, thermocouple having chromel as their positive leg, and the alumel as their negative leg. Alumel is having 5% nickel, and rest is silicon and aluminum. Type N, thermocouple is having nitrocell as its positive leg and a cell as its negative leg. Nitrocell is having 14% nickel and 1.5% chromium and rest is silicon. For color code chart, refer at the chart for your reference. The temperature range in type A in degrees Celsius are 0 to 800 degrees Celsius. In type J, 0 to 750 degrees Celsius. In type K, 0 to 1100 degrees Celsius. In type N, 0 to 1100 degrees Celsius. In type R, 0 to 1600 degrees Celsius. Now, let's proceed to our thermocouple chart. In the left-hand column that I marked are the temperatures can be either degrees Celsius or degree Fahrenheit, and it is tens or hundreds. And on the top horizontal number from 0 to 10 are ones for temperatures to be accurate. And on the inside value are thermoelectric voltage in millivolts. Example is 0.67 millivolts. I point the arrow towards 0.955 millivolts from 70 degree Fahrenheit. Then another vertical arrow from number 5. What is the temperature? 70 plus 5 is 75 degree Fahrenheit. And the reading of the voltmeter should be 0.955 millivolts. On this slide, we're going to discuss the standard percent error of thermocouple. For type K, the percent error is 0.75 or 2.2 degrees Celsius. If we are going to look at the conversion table, more or less 35 degrees Fahrenheit. 